Dave's Tyree and Puzzle is another pretty good daily to level battle pets. Uh, you do need to have the higher level battle pets, though. Uh, mainly because of uh, Tyree and this ability right here, this Omni Slash. It's an AoE and it hits pretty hard, especially if you're a dragon. So I would suggest pets somewhere around level 20 um, to be able to survive. And the pets you want to use for the team to level is going to be a Mechanical Pandarian Dragonling with Breath, Thunderbolt, and Decoy, and a Ruby Droplet with Absorb, Bubble, and Drain Blood. Start with your Dragonling and put up your Decoy right away. And as soon as your decoy's up, that's when you want to swap in your leveling pet to say hello. So bring him in, go hello, let him try to hit you, decoy's going to block it, and bring him back out, bring your dragon back in. Then just breath until this guy dies. Sometimes he does nothing but bone present on you, which is annoying because it does more damage. This one, actually, we get less damage from it because we're mechanical, but... Eh, whatever. Every once in a while we have good RNG like this where we're actually going to live and you can put another decoy up. So, Tyree's going to do his Call Darkness. It'll kill us the first time. We'll come back to life. Set up our decoy. If not, it's fine. Your Ruby Droplet really owns these two humanoids, so it's really not a big deal at all if your Dragonlin uh, dies right there like they normally do. Just gives me a chance to put some extra damage on him. And you can see the AoE. The AoE doesn't do a whole lot of damage to you, so, but it does, you know, that's why you want to, uh, you can see the health going down with my leveling pet right there. That's why you want to not use something that's not pretty high level. Yeah, right, we're finally dead. That was a nice chunk of health, almost took out the first two pets with him. Um, use your bubble right away. You want to use your drain blood for a heal. Not necessarily damage. And since my health's pretty low, I'm going to use it as a heal. Absorb actually does more damage and um, heals as well, so... It's pretty easy to get your health back up very, very quickly, as you can see. Ah, sun dust. Pass. And this pet loves to dodge, and then he does this portal thing. It's basically just another dodge. So, the only thing I can caution you is, if you need to heal, make sure that those abilities aren't up, so you don't do your drain blood right when he can do those abilities. Normally, he only does his dodge on cooldown, though, and he won't do his portal until he's almost dead, so... But almost like clockwork, every time his dodge ability is up, he will use it. And then when his health is fairly low, he will do his portal ability, like I said. So just keep doing absorb. And then heal yourself up and then use bubble on cooldown. It's a little long of a process, but it does work to level those higher pets up. And if we didn't have such good luck with the first pet, see there's this little portal. <laughs> he like goes into nothing. <laughs> and I will dodge. Um, but if I didn't have such good luck with the dragon 
in the beginning with the mechanical Pandaria dragon thing. Uh, this pet basically just do the same exact thing to to Tyree when he comes out. Mm, we should kill him within this round. But, there you go. <laughs> I love the fact he drops through, that's funny. Happy, happy leveling.